Get back up. Got my stuff back. I'm gonna try something. Drop down here. Not sure why I did that. There's something here. I haven't been be I haven't been down here before actually. This is new to me. I just noticed this place. Huh. What could this place offer? What the fuck? Are you? Wait a minute, before we go any further... Yeah, aha! Uh aha, -huh. uh -huh. I am so glad I took the time to look around, or wait, to see what would happen. Kill it. There we go. Yeah. Okay, let's open it. Uh, close this one, I mean. And that makes a shortcut over there. Aha, uh -huh, so that's how it's done. I thought I had looked every single place in this area, but apparently I haven't. Huh. These things are new to me. Oh! Oh fuck! No! Not the maggots! Oh my god! Ugh. Oh, fuck me. Well, this is annoying. Let's kill this guy. Gonna take some more damage. More blood loss. No reason to put on that. Hey, there are enemy, right? Yeah, he doesn't do anything. He must be stuck. Red sign soapstone. So this is where we get it. Aha. Uh -huh. Exactly. Where does this take me? I have no idea. I am on completely new grounds right now. It's a bonfire. Huh. Helm of thorns and armor of thorns. Ah, it's a nurse mother or something like that. Uh, where is it? How do I? There you go. Rosary, a mother of rebirth. Another covenant. Okay. I'll go further into detail about the Covenant at some other time. Not right now, maybe when I'm done with this area I'll take a deeper look into it. Let's just leave this area. Yeah, I need to look at the Forms armor as well. Ah, hello. And this is the only way I can take. Yes, gonna open the door up there. Also, we're gonna grab this. Well, this makes it a little bit more interesting, actually. Much easier to uh, get around the giant. Yeah. Huh. But I need to get the items that the other giant was guarding. The first one I killed. That was flailing with his arms. Get me. <clears throat> yes, this is where I started an episode a couple of episodes ago. Just to show you where we ended up. Wait a minute. Ah, there we go. Are you... 
Oh, fuck me. How do I get down there then? Do I actually have to? I think, oh my God. Oh, damn it. Uh, I have to use the bone. Uh, see you in a jiffy, I'm gonna run up there. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I forgot to mention this area down here. After you open the door to the last uh, shortcut. Don't jump down here if you already uh, got the poison bite ring. It's the same exact area. So there's no re need to get down there right now. Or ever, actually. But if you want to, I won't uh, stop you. Okay, good. I'm gonna ignore him. And I'm gonna go... Ah, hell no. Well, they are not ignoring me. Ah, that was terrible. Absolutely horrific. Uh, at least it's not poison. That's something, right? Okay, good. You're not gonna be spitting at me this entire time. I was afraid you would be doing that. Ooh, no thank you. Don't want that. Soul of a Nameless Soldier. Down here we find a caster item. It's... I, I believe it was... A catalyst? <sighs> bloody doors. Have to be so bloody heavy. How did they get the giant in here? Did they... Did they uh, get the giants before they were fully grown? Like infants or something? A kid? To fit them inside the, the doors? I don't know. Saint Bident. Biden. I think it's Bidden. Uh, it's here actually. Silver Bidden decorated by a holy symbol. Is there something down there? No. Formerly wielded by Saint Klimt. He discarded this. Uh, this weapon that draws upon his one's faith on the day that he put his own faith behind him. Oh, he put his faith behind him. Good for him. Uh, good for him that he chose his own path if he was forced into what he was believing in. Why to be worn by traveling maidens, part of their informal attire, regardless of rank. It is soft and well made, but ill suited for use in battle. Okay, that was all of it. And now to roll a little bit more. It's rolling. Is everything in life? <laughs> gonna go over here. It's gonna be a little bit faster. There we go. Mm -mm. Nope. He's gonna follow me. Kill him when the time comes. Also, there is another gate over here we can op open up. I don't think that's a shortcut though. No, there's only one that is considered a shortcut. The one we walked over. Why is he taking damage? I have no clue. Doesn't bother me though. No, not one bit. Okay, this guy. Holy crap, this is gonna be fun. And this is why I have the fire bombs. To disperse with these creatures. Oh fuck. Uh huh. I'll deal with them here. Dealing with him, if you're a caster, is much easier. Because, you, well, it's just easier as a caster, I've seen. I was helping a person. And he was just th throwing missiles at him, and he died eventually. Ouch. 
Okay. Shit. Now he's not a problem anymore. But now I need to position him so I can hit his legs without him moving. As you can see, as soon as I walk into the water, he reacts. Almost. Almost there. Not there just yet. I did 25 damage per hit. It is so little. Come on, place it here. No, don't want to. Maybe now. Maybe now. It would be lovely. Maybe? I think I'm hitting the feet. Am I? I think so. Yeah, he's taking damage now. So, let's see. I'm gonna equip a couple other items here. Just remove all of those. Replace this with Flynn. And that with... Uh, Lloyd's sword ring. Much time has passed since the worship, worship of Lloyd was common in the Bay of Light, declares that Karim had always strongly asserted that Lloyd was a der derivative fraud and that the old father title was self-proclaimed. Boost attack when power boost attack power when HP is full. That didn't do much. Ah damn it. Please sit down. Please sit down, kind giant. Uh, not happy with this. Whew. Ah, come on. You know, what? I'm just gonna kill him. You've seen my method. And I'm just gonna quickly kill him. Yeah. Finally! Okay, let's change up the rings. Okay, so why did I want him dead? Simple. No, not that. Not the tongue. Not the Titanite Shard. The Drang Armor Set. Yeah, it's awesome looking. Too bad that I haven't found a helmet for it. It might not be a helmet for it. Wait a minute. Is, it, is that the helmet? No, Drang Hammers. Drang. It's a weird name. Drang. Mm, okay, let's uh, equip the Drang set. Also, let's read it. Armor of the Drang Knight. Proclaimed descendants from the land known for the legend of the linking of the fire. Fine protection that is both light and strong, having been reinforced with rare gay steel. The Drag Knights were once feared cell swords until trees and men descending into the abyss, and they were separated forever. Uh, Drag Gauntlets. Yep. Yeah. I am missing an item. And drank shoes. Yes, I am indeed missing an item. Uh, it may be up here. But for some reason, I doubt it. Okay, as long as you don't bother them, they won't bother you. Maybe this is the one. No, that wasn't the one. I'm looking for a helmet. Which I'm not sure about its location. Where did 
what the hell was it? I know it's in the castle. I just don't know remember where. That takes us to uh, the door up above. That takes us out to the outside. Oh. Annoying. Shit, I thought he died. Alas, he did not. Okay, do I have to kill you? Or can I walk past you? He didn't like that. It's okay, it's okay. Oh. Did I summon him? I don't think so. Okay, he's leaving. Good. No, no, no. Why did I summon her? Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. She can help him with this guy. I gotta try the boss without help of an uh, of a phantom. Yeah, he's dead now. Under the story, you can leave. Where is that item? I wait. No, no, no. It might not be in here. It may not be here. No, it might be in a different location. Actually, any users. Let's throw worse. No! Fuck. I need to kill myself. Uh, equip. I'll see you in a moment. So the reason why I wanted to die is because I need to summon Ceres of the Sunless Realm. I think I need to summon her now, here and another location, to progress her storyline. That is why I'm summoning her. There we go. And also notice that when you use uh, a Ring of Sacrifice, you do not preserve your humanity. It's annoying. Okay, boss fight. You see the red aura? That's the one you need to focus on. And it scatters to another one. Then the one you were attacking dies. And they will keep respawning. Doesn't mean you shouldn't attack them all like this. Makes it a little bit easier. Oh, it's you. And eventually, the main dude himself should come. Eventually. I think I think he comes now, actually. Yep, there he is. Ah, balls. Ball sacks. Okay, time to heal. No, that's not what I had in mind. I'm being bombarded here. Which is not all that great, truthfully. He's almost dead. And there we go. Ah, uh, it's such an easy fight. And she's gone. So all of the deacons of the something something. Uh, let's see. So all of the deacons of the deep won't fit his all state in strength. After Eldritch left for the Boreal Valley, Archdeacon... Uh, Archdeacon Royce remained in the cathedral with the high priests. To keep eternal watch over their master's coffin. 
Uh. Oh, I thought I gave her the ashes. Oh. Okay. Small silverwork doll depicting a young esquire. In the legendary old city of Erifil, situated in the Boreal Valley, the Pontiff Sullivan gave his doll to valued subjects, so that they might use it to cross the barrier when they return home. Listen carefully, and you can hear it say, Wherever you go, the moon still sets in Erifil. Wherever you may be, Erifil is your home. You can now go to Erifil, I believe. But that is for another time. Ah, uh, yes. Can I interact with something here? I don't think so. Okay, so that was yet another really simple boss. Uh, so many of them. Uh, let's head back to uh, uh, the shrine quickly. And we uh, give the paladin ash. Ooh. Also, I have forgotten to speak with these guys. Oh, and we meet again. We spoke before on the road of sacrifices. Anri of Astora. I'm well pleased to see you safe. We reached the Cathedral of the Deep, but Aldridge's coffin was empty. The man-eater must have left for his true home. The little doll in the empty coffin told me. Aldridge is set to hail from Irithil in the Boreal Valley, an ancient fabled city. A pilgrim told me that the city lies beyond Farron Keep, and so becomes our destination. Beyond Farron Keep, that means beyond the catacombs as well. <laughs> <laughs> Aldridge's honest home is Irithil in the Boreal Valley, an ancient fabled city. A pilgrim to Okay, so that's all he has to tell us. Let us go deliver the book that we found to the priestess. Uh, nun? I think she was a nun, not a priestess. Oh, did you? Give her the divine too. Wait, I hadn't given her, her. Wait, what? I thought I gave her that one. Oh, you've brought me a braille divine tome. I was certain I gave now her that. I can tell new tales and miracles. Did I get tales a new one? of the greater miracles can be quite the epics. What fun we will have. I don't remember. <laughs> oh, what's this? Champion of Ash, this divine tome is forbidden. These are dark tales of things that lurk deep within men. These stories would not please you. Of course, if you insist, I will read them for you. Only... Oh, oh, they frighten me so. The little creatures that nibble at me in the darkness. The little creatures that nibble at me in the darkness. No. Some insects swarm to feast the foes. I think that's what she... Uh, have a pleasant journey, Champion. I pray for your safe. I think that's what's oh, nibbling at her. You know, in my home of Kareem, I will, but if I had a dinner. Okay, she got nothing else to tell us. I don't think he has anything either. He's here still. Ah, this what needs me. Uh, let's see. Infused weapon. Heavy. Do I have lightning? I don't have any lightning yet. That irritates me a little bit. Uh huh. Ma, infusing weapons with. Okay, that's all he has to say. Oh, Do you have anything? Anyone. Doesn't look like it. Nothing that I would like. Goodbye. So let's give her the ashes of the paladin. Ah. Gracious. Passing fine ash. I'm sorry I didn't them. give it to her sooner, I thought I did. Let this ash be stone nourishment. 
I only hope these new wares content thee. <laughs> Purple moss. Yes! I gotta buy 50 of those. Yeah, 50. You heard me right. 50. Uh, I hate the place. Enorm the sage's big hat. The enormous hat that completely obscures the face. Belong to uh, twin girls known as the Crystal Sages. The pair are said to be successor to the great sage Logan. And this big hat is a symbol of their pedigree. After the legion's watchers became lords of Cinder, the wolf blood dried up and Farron was consumed by festering wood. Within the wood, an emaciating old wolf commands watchdog to defend the san sanctity of sleeping warriors. Both the exiles were surely watchdogs themselves, but for Farron has always been a land of itinerance. Okay. Ashen one, be sure to bring me. Welcome, husband. Very well, then. Level up a little bit. Let's see. I really think I want more luck. But no. <laughs> no. Hmm. <clears throat> I really don't know what to do, but take. I think it'll take more strength. Farewell, Ashen. Also, we did get a new item, uh, Soul, so let's uh, check it out. Aha, that returns. Begin. Soul of a Crystal Sage. Deacons of the Deep, Cleric's Candlestick. Uh, the Deacons. Under the guidance of Arctic and McDonald became both clergymen and sorcerers. That's all he has to say, apparently. Now, now. Do not be away. This guy. Ooh, yeah. Good. The what do you really know about? Let's take a right. That's all he has to say. This guy's gone. That's unfortunate. And one last NPC before we quit. Speak, thy honorable. Talk. That a law bearer for the and I of. Okay. Till we meet again. That's all she has to say. Well, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed these couple of episodes. Clearing out the uh, cathedral or chapel. So, yeah. Hope you enjoyed it and hope to see you again next time. Bye.